This is a Segovian suckling pig. It's an absolute delicacy in a traditional Spanish dish. A cuchinillo or suckling pig is slaughtered when it's between two and six weeks old and weighs less than 10 pounds. It has only been fed on its mother's milk and its meat is incredibly tender and succulent. Segovian pig can be hard to source. I got this one from meatandbone.com. They ship nationwide. I'm seasoning it well with garlic, onion and salt. And don't forget to pierce the skin with a sharp knife so that it can crisp out nicely during the end of the cook. For today's cook, I'm going to use Fogo Premium Charcoal. It's perfect for a short smoking session like today's. Because the flavor of the pig is so delicate, I'm not going to add any wood for additional flavor. Roasting the pig on a bed of potatoes. As you will see in a bit, these come out absolutely spectacular, cooked to perfection in pig fat. I'm smoking the suckling pig for about 3 hours at 300 degrees and then crank up the heat very carefully to around 425 degrees to get that crispy skin but not burn it. You really have to watch it. Alright guys, this was a very intense but a lot of fun cook. We have a Segovian style suckling pig and I'm joined here again by Herman from Meat and Bones. Hey man, thanks for all coming, thanks for coming back and for bringing me this delicacy, it's incredible. No, always welcome man, it's uh, <laughs> always fun to do this kind of stuff with you. Yeah, this is crazy, Where? so tell me about this thing. Okay, this is a Florida pig, all right. uh, it's raised in the north of Florida. It's uh, Called Segovian style because it's the the, the way that is raised the pig. Yeah. It's as humanely as it can be. Okay. okay. Uh, each mother has their own pan. Uh, they are taking care daily. The um, yeah, because this, this is basically suckling pig. Yeah, this right? is a uh, it's a baby. This is a baby. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's uh, it's uh, in it to be, in order to be able to be called a Segovian style, it has to be no more than ten pounds. Okay, okay. And uh, yeah. it's a pig that is going to be between two and six weeks old. Oh, okay, and, um, okay. Lastly, yeah, this was 8.8 .8 pounds? Yeah, exactly. Okay, okay. And um, this pig has been uh, separate, like it's been slaughtered when it reaches the wind, wind, wind point. So it, this pig okay. has... In order to be a suckling pig, a real yeah. suckling pig. Oh, when they wean it off. Yeah, yeah. they wean yeah. it off at the yeah, yeah. and at the six weeks. Yeah, yeah. So it's about to be ready to eat, uh, you know, uh, proper food, hay or whatever. Yeah, this uh, and not have milk anymore. This has only eaten only milk. Eat milk. Okay, like, yeah. so you should be able to tell that what in the in the consistency of the meat and the flavor it's, of the meat. It's yeah. totally different. It's soft. It's sweet. It's, okay. Uh, it's a really, really, really butter in your mouth. <laughs> uh, I want to stop talking and try it out. I've never, I've never had this. And, and uh, what I love, look how the, these potatoes came out. So basically, we had the pig on, um, what was it like? Sort of like a... It's called a, a cazuela. 
Yeah, it's like a, Spanish, it's like a roasting pan sort of yeah, thing. It, it's in a Spanish dish that where yeah. where there's a Gobian pig. It's cooked uh, inside. Yeah. We try to do it the traditional style. Yeah, we yeah. Uh, um, uh, at least as much as we tr <laughs> we can, you know. Um, and then, so basically, we filled uh, the 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 roasting pan with potatoes and nothing else, pretty much just some water, yep. and then put the pig on top. And and I mean, look at this. Looks like bacon potatoes, like almost like fried bacon potatoes or something of like that. It's crazy. All, <laughs> all the fat that melt uh, from the suckling pig, it laid on top of the potatoes yeah. and it cooked them together. So all the flavor Looks incredible. is right there. Yeah. All right, let's have a look at the pig. So come on a little bit closer on the pig. Let's see if we got it, if you did a good job. You know, like it should be a little crunchy. Let's see. Like, do you like this? Yeah, sounds good, right? You can tap it. Oh yeah, look at look. Listen, listen to this. Oh, you hear that? Yeah, of course. Oh, it's incredible. Let's try it out. It's crazy. Let me let me take the leg off. Oh, look at this. It you just falls just apart. It out, oh, look yeah. at look at this. Oh my god. In Segovia, this is it's very traditional to cut it with a plate, just oh, to yeah. prove how soft it is. Yeah. Oh, I can imagine. I mean, we don't even have a plate, but we can probably just take this apart with. Uh, you know, just like this. Look, look yeah. at this. It folds right apart. Incredible. But the skin is crazy. It's like crunchy, like nothing I've ever had before. Crazy. Because I guess it doesn't have that, you know, like a, an older pig has a lot more fat too. Of this course. doesn't have that as much, as it's much fat. It's a thin skin. Yeah. Um, it's not a big mm. layer of fat on the underneath, so it's not going to create a lot of moist to make it soft. So it's incredible. Well, I, I love that. That was amazing. Let me try the meat. Wow, look at that. Just, just kind of falls apart. Look, we got a little bit of a smoke ring almost. I put no smoking wood in this. This was basically just, just charcoal. So it should have a nice little, a little bit of a smoky hint, but nothing too overpowering. Oh, it's amazing. Mm -hmm very moist you know very it's moist juicy it's uh, flavorful kind of actually sweet flavor yeah. on it yeah like creamy almost too mm -hmm. incredible easy <laughs> it's crazy how about the potatoes just like eating the pig it's potato pig flavored <laughs> <laughs> this is pretty amazing. Mm -hmm. Wow. You wouldn't think you can take a potato, make it that good, huh? It's like baste it in bacon fat. It's mm. perfection. Wow. Wow, this this is good. I can't believe I never had this before. So where do they normally sell this in like restaurants, like Spanish yeah, restaurants? The, um, this is the kind of pig that you will find in high-end Spanish restaurants. The reason why you, you're you not able to find it easily uh, out there is because the yield on the pig. Uh, it's yeah, a small pig, yeah. so it's not a very, um, how do you call it? Like uh, you, you cannot make a lot of money yeah. out of it because yeah. of the size. Yep. So uh, we finally found a farm that uh, was doing the right thing and uh, this is the real. No, this, this, is, this, is, this is crazy. Yeah. This is a real suckling pig. Yeah. Yeah, I'll totally do this again. I, I want to do this for, for like family and friends, and you know, this is this is different than. Also, you know, when you do this like whole hog, sixty pounds, eighty pounds, first of all, it doesn't have the flavor. The 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 meat is sort of a bit, bit like blah, you know, like a bit bland. Yeah. And it's a lot harder to cook. I mean, this was easy. Look at the but, baby back, the size of it. <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> this took us three hours to cook. Yeah. And it's absolutely amazing, super soft, super tender, amazing crackling. I mean, I can't get this done sometimes on a big pig because it's so big, you know, it's difficult to manage the whole process. Yeah, and uh, the good thing is that if you are if you know how to control your grill, you can always uh, just set it to 200 degrees yeah. and it's going to do it, cook it by itself. Yeah, it, yeah. it doesn't require a lot of work, so it's easy. No, this, this is amazing. Yeah, thank you so much. Mm -hmm. And so basically, you guys are also a uh, one of the very few kind of suppliers of this, right? Like you can't really just get this in any supermarket, in any sort of meat market. This is almost like a specialty item 
you know, almost like a caviar or wagyu kind of thing, you know. Yeah, we at Meat and Bone, we dedicate ourselves in finding those specialty cuts and specialty items that are at hard are to get, hard to get yeah, yeah. in the U.S. And this is one of those delicacies that you can just absolutely really incredible enjoy it. Yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. I mean, this is this was amazing. Uh, this totally blew me away. This is incredible. <laughs> Thank no, you so much for coming. You. Um, yeah, guys, I mean, I think this wraps up the episode. I mean, I just want to keep eating. So, <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this episode. All of you guys need to try this at home. This is incredible. You have never eaten anything like this. This is, I mean, this is absolutely amazing. You have to try this out for yourself. Um, I hope you guys liked this episode. And if you did, don't forget to like, share it with your friends and subscribe to our channel. See you again next week. Ciao, ciao. Yeah.